Right, some more breaking transfer news. It looks like Ludwig Augustinsson, I think I pronounced his name right, uh, is signed on to Villa uh, on a loan deal from Seville as a left back. Um, and it looks like he's going to be someone competing for the role against Luca Digne. Um, and, you know, as a backup left back, it's quite a good decision from Villa. Uh, it's good business as well because we're all thinking if Cruzines will be our be backup. But I think the guy is around 18 years old and obviously he hasn't got much Premier League experience. I don't know if he has actually played in the Premier yet. But um, it looks like Cruzine will probably be loaned out to the Championship, maybe League 1 or League 2. I hope it happens anyway, but I just want to say this is good business from Villa. Um, another good sign in my opinion. Someone obviously is not just coming in to a Villa side where he doesn't know anyone. He knows Carlos, obviously. Um, and whether he does get any game time, I think he probably will because we all know Luca Digne. He is injury prone. Um, and there was that one game against West Ham where he went off with a bad stomach. So, you know, this guy will probably come in, have some game time. I'm not saying he's going to have a lot. But he will probably have some game time, and I can't lie. I'm not. I don't know too much about him, but what I've seen about him, he is highly rated, and it's just good business from Villa. Obviously, we didn't want to go in and buy another left back. I don't think there was much point in it. We've got such good talent coming up from the youth academy. Um, you know, in seasons to come, that will probably be our our first option uh, as the left back role. Uh, obviously, being cuisine, but yeah, it's good business from Villa at the end of the day. Uh, I don't think this will be the last transfer coming in. I think we'll probably see one more or even two more. Um, I think it goes without saying we are going to be getting another midfielder. Who's it going to be? I will say it again, if if we do actually go for Conor Gallagher, this will probably be the best transfer window we've had at Villa like in recent years uh, because we've just gone for every position we've needed for once. And... Um, you know, Conor Gallagher obviously is a young young guy as well, but he's had plenty of loan deals, uh, going to West Brom, Swansea, Crystal Palace, obviously where he flourished a lot. But you know, if we do get Conor Gallagher in, I do believe we are in contention for top six. But yeah, I think the transfer window is definitely not done yet for Villa. But yeah, that's been Ludwig Augustinsson. Uh, some more good business from Villa, and uh, yeah, up the Villa with the pride of Villa. We'll see you in the next video.